hello guys in this video we will learn how we can use document dot ready function and window dot load function so basically both function we use to uh, to show any data just after the page load but the main difference is there like the document dot ready function like does not work will not be appropriate to work if we are using uh, to change something related to image height width or anything for that we need or we must need to use window dot load function because that will be good to handle like the change of images sizes change of any media content any object so when we use all the things on a on a on a web page then we must need to use we must use the window dot load okay and document dot ready is good for like doing manipulation in the data on a on on a on just a, on a page load event so let's see the demonstration so let me run this page first so uh, I am opening it in the browser so here you can see the page is being loaded now so at the first time you can see alert from document dot ready method okay we are currently getting alert from document dot ready function and you can see that function right here this is the alert right and we are getting it from document dot ready so when I will click on ok then it will load the media content and you can see after loading the media content we got alert from window dot load method and we will again got an alert we have again got an alert from window dot load event basically here in the code i have used two way to use window dot load method okay so so we can use either any uh, like any one we can use and both of them will work very well and you can you, you just saw that example we got alert from both of the window load event uh, like method during the win completion of window when window loaded fully including like all frames objects and images so just after loading all frames images and objects we got the alert from window dot load function okay so you got the idea like where we can use window dot load and where we can use uh, document dot ready so document dot ready will is will be the best uh, place to work to do any changes related to the data like suppose we want to add here like do some changes related to um, related to like doing some calculation of data or, or previewing the data from the database or we, we can we can take it anything for like we can, any example we can get we can take for that suppose I want to multiply 4 into 3 so these kind of data it will be the best to use window dot ready sorry document dot ready and for doing some manipulation related to the images or media content we must need to use window dot load so you got the difference about the document dot ready method or function and window dot load function right so that's all guys in this video let me know your suggestions or your queries in in the comment below in the comment section okay thank you guys thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe to the channel thank you